Welcome to San Jose City College where we have a good one brewing tonight. Mitty at Bellarmine. Spoke to Mitty before the game. They said that it's all going to be about ball control. Whoever has the most time of possession at the end of the game, they figure is going to come out the victor. So strap on your seatbelts, everybody. It's the monster game. The Bellarmine crowd was more than excited pregame, looking to get into next week's championship match. And early on, the Bells gave their fans something to cheer about as Tim Crawley takes the handoff in the red zone to the one-foot line. He thought he was in, but no worries. They'll go right back to the speedster, and he gets them across. Mix extra point. Six to nothing. Bellarmine. Midi was no slouch in the early going, though, as the defense was making some big plays. Deion Wyndham with a big sack right there to force a punt. But the Bells would get the ball right back. Then quarterback Travis McHugh would get going. The 6'3", 205-pounder has got some speed as well. In the quarterback draw, he gets inside the 10-yard line. Three plays later, Bellarmine would give it to Crawley again and let him work. Huge hole for the halfback. He spins in for the 13-0 lead with a minute and 10 left in the first half. Mitty trying to get something going before the intermission, but maybe they should have ran out the clock because Joey Sanfilippo will pick up the pass with 18 seconds left. The Bells get inside the 20 with six-tenths of a second and capitalize on the turnover as McHugh hits the field goal. 16-0 advantage. Bellarmine would intercept Mitty on the second half's opening drive. They're inside the 10, and when you're that close, why would you give it to anyone else but Tim Crawley? 22 nothing. Then in the fourth quarter, the Bells would just pour it on. McHugh rolls left, but will throw back to his right to who else? Tim Crawley. That would be four touchdowns for the senior. And a 29 to zip lead. Mitty trying to get on the board late, but Alex Manigo will pick off the Monarch pass. He nets a little return, fumbles the ball, but gets it right back. And that's how it went tonight for Bellarmine. The ball was just bouncing their way as they earn a trip back to the Open Division Championship game with a 29 to nothing shutout. You know, defense wins championships, and you know, by the look of the scoreboard, they definitely they definitely got their job done tonight. You know, ever since 2009, it's been our ultimate goal. You know, ever since the start of the season, um, we're just really trying to push the season as far as it can go, and uh, we're doing everything we can to get there. So, you know, we're just practicing hard every week. Um, you know, really wanting uh, to win the game, having a lot of pride in what we do. And, uh, you know, hopefully, uh, you know, if we play well, we'll see what happens next week. At San Jose City College for the Monster Game, I'm Taylor Lambert, Cal High Sports Bay Area.